hi everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Bailey this is Maverick my service dog in training and then I have a Bernese Mountain Dog her name is Mercedes and she is a pet and today's video is so exciting I cannot wait to film this weekend because it is a road tripping to some cabins dog friendly cabins I'm gonna take you guys along on just traveling with dogs and kind of a dog friendly vacation so today is actually Friday and we're not coming back till Monday so just a little weekend cabin vacation um, just to get away and just do something with the dogs where we can bring them along um, I am all packed as you can see this is my suitcase this is like stuff for the car my electronics this duffel bag is everything for the dogs and then I do have a separate bag just for their kibble but that should be enough for this weekend so like I mentioned we are going to some cabins out in East Texas I will definitely give you a tour of the cabin it looks so nice it has a fenced in yard you're just out in the woods and I, I'm just so excited to get away and again just do something for my dogs this weekend we will be doing some hiking and then just exploring some small like town areas and then also just finding dog friendly activities or dog friendly restaurants as well which i will definitely take you guys along for sorry maverick keeps moving he's just so excited to go on his first vacation um but if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up hit that subscribe button down below so you can join our pause of purpose fam i make a lot of pet related content as well as service dog related content with maverick here and yeah we still need to load up the car and let's get this traveling video started all right so this is our setup um all of the stuff that my dad and i are bringing are here the rest of my family is meeting us tonight after work they didn't take off um so yeah we're gonna fit one two three four plus mercedes she's inside in the back of here and then my dad and i are gonna drive to East Texas. So there's Maverick, there's Roscoe and Ruger, my dad unloading the Jeep. So they do have a small cabin over there, um, but this is what it looks like. So beautiful. This is the Piney Woods area of Texas and this is the what they call the big cabin. Um, it has a fully fenced in yard, which is super nice, super dog friendly. Um, it has the wires and it even goes all the way down to the ground so um, my dad and I walked to the perimeter of the fence and it's super secure so so that's awesome they have some horseshoe right here and it goes all the way back there if you can see the fence and then they have trails they have um, seven acres so super nice might have to do that and they have hammock and a volleyball net and they have this awesome little outside fire pit got some wood for you to use and some string lights which I'm sure will turn on <laughs> when it gets dark Mav is having so much fun running around right Maverick 
Maverick, what you doing there? Are you having fun? Mercedes is inside because of her knee and she can't really run around. But she already got to explore when we walked around the perimeter. And yeah, this is the big cabin. All right, so they have this huge porch, which looks like this. They have a grill for you to use. And it looks like they got some toys here. I mean, like, chuck it, that's awesome. <laughs> I didn't even really look in here. Volleyball, tennis balls. It looks like they got a chuck it ball, so that's awesome, just super dog friendly. They got some cornhole. This cute little dog bed that matches like the wood um, seating out here. That is so cute. Can't wait to get some pictures in there. And let's give you guys the tour inside. All right, so when you walk inside, this is the common area. This is what it looks like. I got Mercedes. She's chilling. I know. You did such a good ride here. So yeah, she's in the crate because of her knee. So this is the living room. And I just love the decor around. They got the fireplace. The TV, and then it looks like they have some dog blankets over here, which is super awesome. Very thoughtful, and you can tell too, like the floors are really dog friendly. And then on this side, or in the middle, like right when you walk in, is the big dining table, blessed. And then we brought this crate and that crate. And then this is the little kitchen area. Um, looks like they have, oh my gosh, you guys, when I first saw this, look, I'll open this a little later, but Maverick, Mercedes, and Moose. I almost cried when I saw that. So thank you, Angela. Looks like they got some treats here, some snacks, super fun. So we brought this bag of snacks, but it looks like they have a little coffee tea station. And I haven't even looked at these. You know, they have the basics. So very nice. And I just love the windows and <laughs> you can see the doggies outside. And then they have a little laundry room, so some cleaning supplies if you need it. This looks like dog towels. Oh, the microwave is in here. I actually have not walked into this room yet. <laughs> it looks like they have some doggy shampoo. Let's see what's in this one. And yeah, they have some laundry stuff, cleaning stuff if you need it, ironing board. <laughs> Maverick can see me. So, laundry room, and then the store right here is the primary. So, my parents are gonna be staying in this one. Ugh, look how beautiful. So beautiful. Here is the Attached bathroom. Nice walk-in shower. They have windows at the top. So light can still come through. And then they have this huge walk-in closet. And then they actually provide a crate as well, which is super nice. And this concrete flooring is throughout, so. I love that, especially with dogs. And this one comes with the TV. I'm not sure if the other ones do though. Crazy tongue. All right, moving to the other two bedrooms. So it's three bedroom. So I'll do this one first. So this one has a work desk 
and it has, I believe this is a queen. Um, so this is what it looks like. You have a window there and then it has a built-in dresser and then these two are like closet and linen closet kind of stuff. So boring, not gonna show you that. And then that's the second bedroom. So I'm staying in this one and this one comes with two beds <laughs> and I just love the artwork in this one. I just love the style of it, but these sleeping puppies. So cute. Um, nightstands, window, and then again with the built-in dresser and like closet linen closets and all of my junk. And then um, it has a bathroom to share between the two bedrooms. So it has this little sink area There's me, and then a second door for the shower. So, it looks like they have some shampoo, conditioner, body wash, and again with the window at the top. Super nice though. Some towels. So yeah, that was the whole cabin and like the fenced in yard area. I definitely want to explore the property, the seven acres. I know they have some like features along the trails maybe. I know at least one that I definitely want to check out, but I'll definitely take you guys along for that. So right now we are waiting on a delivery before like getting groceries and all that stuff. Um, so when I'm filming this, like I kind of mentioned in the beginning, it's Friday, but it is Friday. April 5th and on the 10th which is I believe this coming Wednesday is Mercedes second birthday I cannot believe she's two years old and just to celebrate um, I picked this weekend because it was close to her birthday um, but Lazy Pines is actually partnering with Lily and Max Pet Bakery. Again, just super dog friendly. Um, they have a lot of suggestions for like dog friendly restaurants, things to do, which I will definitely share with you guys. But yeah, I thought it'd be fun to get Mercedes something for her birthday from this pet bakery. So we're just waiting for the cake and cookies that I got Mercedes to be delivered. She sent me a picture and I am so excited. It's pink. It's just so cute and obviously the dogs can eat it and share it so I probably won't be doing that until Sunday because I think we'll have time Sunday morning I don't think we'll have time tomorrow um, but it does keep in the fridge so it'll be fine for like a day and a half two days so yeah I am so excited to see it in person but yeah that's what we're waiting on and yeah I think we're just gonna kind of unload relax let the dogs run outside and, and yeah I'm also gonna just take care of Mercedes walk around on a leash because she can't She's on just like limited bed rest. Um, so yeah, that is what we're up to.
I've been getting a lot of clips of what I'm doing, but I, I actually haven't talked to you guys in a while. It is 11.34 right now and we're all going to bed. Um, my mom, brother, and brother's girlfriend, Jess, who you guys have seen on my channel if you watch my channel, um, they just got here like an hour ago. Um, they just, it was just a long drive after work, so. So yeah, we're all here now, and kind of just to recap what we did, um, once we got here, we unloaded, and the dogs are just like running crazy. Um, this is like such a nice cabin. Again, it is the Lazy Pines cabin in Corrigan, Texas. They also have a New Mexico cabin in Rudizio, I think is how you say it. Anyways, um, we unloaded, and then we went into a nearby town, Got some groceries. I've never been to a Brookshire Brothers before. So yeah, that was kind of cool, I guess. And then and then my dad and I picked up some Dairy Queen for dinner and the blizzard was just so good. And then we brought it back here and we watched Saving Private Ryan. Just a good movie. I think I've seen it before, but like not all the way through. And then yeah, then the rest of my family showed up and the dogs are having so much fun. They are running around. Poor Mercedes, she can't really do that, but she's having fun and you know, she gets all the attention because all the other dogs are outside running around. So um, yeah, all the dogs are tired, which I do have Maverick in the room with me. Mercedes is in the crate just so she won't like jump on the bed and hurt her knee more, but yeah. He is passed out. So yeah, that is going to be the end of this video. Really just road tripping with four dogs, which sounds crazy and it is, but it's like a manageable kind of crazy. They honestly really did well for a pretty much like four hour car ride but yeah that is going to be the end of this portion make sure you stick around so you see what we do all the dog friendly stuff that we're doing this weekend and yeah just come along with me and my dogs as we take a vacation together <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and we will catch you on our next video bye friends mm -hmm.